Hello, I'm Thomas. Nice to meet you. Would you like to hear a story of how I went to the smelter's yard? Hmm? Yeah, mm-hmm. Well, I can tell you the story of how I went to the smelter's yard. Yeah. Well, mm-mm. <clears throat> well, you want me to tell you how the story of how I went to the smelter's yard? Hmm? Well, that's good. Okay, I can tell you. Mm-hmm. Well, you see, it all started one a long time ago. Yeah, mm-hmm. Here on the island of Sodor. I, I was here in the, mm, uh, you know, what place I was, yeah. I was in Timnit Sheds all alone. Yes, I was. Mm-hmm. I was in Timnit Sheds all alone. Yes, I was. Mm-hmm. And you see, mm-hmm, I was just chilling. Yeah, I was. Mm-hmm. Even though I was relaxing. Yeah, I was. Mm-hmm. And enjoying my life. Yeah, here in Tidmouth Sheds on the island of Sodor. Yes, I was. Mm-hmm. It's so fantastic. Mm-hmm. Because I am awesome. Yeah, I am. <laughs> you can't you see? This is so fantastic. Yeah, it is. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Here, yes, I was relaxing. Yeah, I was. But, you see, I am having so much fun here in Tidmouth Sheds. Yeah, I am. Mm-hmm. Even though I'm an awesome tank engine. Yeah, I am. But can't you see? What should I do today? I said. Hmm. But I am feeling kind of, you know, so, ugh, so tired, I said. Like, I feel like resting my wheels, I said. Well, like, I yawned. Like, ugh, I yawned, so I feel like decided to take a nap, I said. So, I decided to take a nap. You see... I was enjoying my life, and all of a sudden, I decided to take a nap, mm -hmm, on the island of Sodor, yes, mm -hmm. and all of a sudden, well, yeah, <clears throat> I was resting, yes, I was, mm -hmm. yeah, I, so I decided to snooze my eyes off, yeah, mm -hmm. even though for goodness sake, yeah, I was, mm -hmm. <laughs> Even though I love telling this story, yes, mm-hmm, because I'm an awesome tank engine, and I'm also cheeky, yeah, I am, but no worries, it's okay, mm-hmm, yeah, you see, I'm an awesome tank engine, yeah, so I decided to go in to the sheds to sleep, yeah, so I decided to close my eyes while wearing my nightcap, yep, you see, it's very interesting, yeah, mm-hmm, even though I'm an awesome tank engine, so, yeah, mm-hmm, I'm a very, uh, ain't I awesome when I sleep? Yeah, I am, aren't I? Mm-hmm, yeah, definitely, mm-hmm, yeah, mm-hmm, <laughs> I'm like an angel when I sleep, aren't I? Yeah, it's so true, mm-hmm, because I am number one, that is so true, uh-huh, yes, definitely, that is so true, yes, definitely, mm-hmm. Ooh, it's so true. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> this is so true. Yes. Mm-hmm. Even though, for goodness sake, yes, definitely. Mm-hmm. Ooh, you see, it's so awesome. Yeah. But then, all of a sudden, I, I felt something very strange. Yes, I did. Yes. A dream cloud approached. Yes. Mm-hmm. And then... I had this weird feeling. Yes, I did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I certainly did. Yes, I did. But then, all of a sudden, yes, I'm starting to feel dreamy. Yes, I am. Uh-huh. That is so true. Yeah, it's so true. Yes, definitely. Yes, that is so true. Yes. Mm-hmm. Like, an awesome thing. Yeah, you see... On the island of Sodor, I decided to sleep. Yeah, so I'm feeling a little dreamy inside. Yeah, but the dream cloud approached my head. Yes, it did. Uh-huh. But then, yeah, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. But then, it, it was silent. Yeah, it was. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. I was so dreamy. Yes, I was. Uh-huh. In my funnel. Yeah, uh-huh. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, the dream cloud decided to show up in my funnel. Yes, it did. Uh-huh. But then, yes, it was so true. Uh-huh. I decided to wake up in my dream. Yes, I did. I woke up this morning, but then, yes. Uh-huh. Well, I was talking to my friend. His name was Percy. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, I decided to do an urgent delivery. Percy and I was talking while I was doing something. Yeah, it's so true. Uh-huh. Like a awesome type of thing. Yes, definitely. Uh-huh. Yes, that is so true. Uh-huh. But then, uh, I yawned again. Yes, I did, because it was really morning. But one scary morning, my eyes mm, wouldn't stay open, but they did. Yep, they did. Uh-huh. That is so true. Uh-huh. <clears throat> like an awesome tank engine I was. Yeah, that's so true. Uh-huh. Whew! Like a nut. Yeah. Uh-huh. That is so true, bro. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But then, my pal decided to, uh, show up. Yep. Mm-hmm. My pal. Yep. Definitely. Like a nut. Uh-huh. Ooh, it's so obvious. Yep. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Yep. That is so true. Uh-huh. Yep. Definitely, bro. Mm-hmm. For goodness sake. Yep. So I went to get some water. Yes. I did. Uh-huh. Hey, Percy, I said. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's so true. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's so true, bro. Uh-huh. But then, yeah. It was so interesting. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey, Percy. I said. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like a nut. Mm-hmm. Whoa. Cinders and ashes, I said. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> hey, Percy. I said. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is so interesting, god dang it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like a barnacle. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Whoa. This is so interesting. I said, mm-hmm, oh, mm, my goodness, mm. well, Percy started to talk to me about the smelter's yard, yeah, he did, uh, I wasn't so convinced, yeah, I wasn't, huh, hey, Thomas, said, Percy said, y haven't you heard about the smelter's yard, Percy said, like a nut, mm-hmm, well, Percy was convinced about the smelter's yard, I said, like a nut, Mm-hmm. Well, Percy was convinced. Yeah, he was. Mm-hmm. Percy really was convinced, I said. Yeah, mm-hmm. Like a nut, he was. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Percy was convinced. Uh, mm. Hey, Thomas, haven't you heard about the smelter's yard? Well, here, I'll tell you, Percy said. It, it all, st it all started. The... There is a giant claw in the smelter's yard, Percy said. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Yeah, mm-hmm. Uh -huh. There is a giant claw, Percy said, and it will grab you. Yes, it will, Percy said. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Even though I wasn't convinced about the smelter's yard. Yeah, mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Yeah. What's the smelter's yard, I said, like a nut. Even though I wasn't really convinced. Yeah, mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Uh, uh, Percy, what is the smelter's yard, I said. Uh, I'm, I'm nervous, I said. Um, uh, per Percy, uh, are you sure? What is the smelter's yard, I said. Um, uh, um, uh, you should know, Percy. I, I don't know about the smelter's yard, I said. Um, all right. Are you sure about this, Percy? I said. Um, uh, even though the smelter's yard is not perfect, it's scary. Even though, for goodness sake, I gulped. Even though, I don't know about this. I wasn't convinced. Percy was convinced. Well, Thomas, Percy said. I'll tell you. It all started. Well, it all started when... The smelter's yard was really convinced. It's convincing. And, and all that stuff, Percy said. And it has this giant claw that it 
will scrap you by mistake. Yes, it will. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And all that stuff. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Like a nut. Mm-hmm. Percy said. Even, even though it's like a nut. Mm-hmm. Yes. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Like a barnacle. Mm-hmm. Yes, per Percy said. Well, bother the smelter's yard. Mm -hmm. Bother. And I don't give a crap. Per and, and, and all that. Jeez, said, I said. Uh, and bother the smelter's yard. And bother. I'm not going. You can't make me, Percy, I said. For goodness sake. Jeez Louise. Ugh. What's your daggum problem, Percy? I don't want to get scrapped. Oh, my God. Mm, even though, Thomas said, I said, I'm like, what the heck? What's your deal? I'm not going to the smelter's yard, I said crossly. What the heck is your problem? Jeez Louise. Ugh. Even, even though. And bother. I don't want to do this. I said crossly. Like, what the heck? You know, for goodness sake. Jeez. Huh. I, I, I didn't want to go to the smelter's yard. And besides, it's so creep, I said. Jeez Louise. Huh. Even though. Huh. Oh, my God. Huh. Even though. Who cares about a smelter's yard? I said. Oh, my God. What's your problem, Percy? Huh. Well, Thomas. Percy said, you should know it's really safe. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Even though Percy was really convinced. Yeah. Well, said Percy, I like to do this for fun. And I'm not going with you. You like a nut. Uh, Tom Thomas really wasn't convinced about going to the smelters. Uh, I I'm not sure about this, Percy, said Thomas. Uh, uh I said, but, uh, Percy, I don't want to be scrapped. So can you go with me, please? Like a nut? Hmm? Like a barnacle head? Uh, can you? But Percy decided to trick Thomas. Uh, I, I'm not going with you, Thomas. It's just a joke. Can't you take a joke? I'm not going with you. Well, of course I'll go with you, but I'm not going. It's just a joke. Can't you see? It's just for fun. <laughs> so you'll have to go by yourself, Thomas. Te Percy teased. Even though it's for fun. So have fun. <laughs> Even though, for goodness sake. <laughs> Thomas thinks this was a joke. Uh, Thomas... Even though Thomas thinks this is a joke. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for goodness sake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Even though Thomas thinks this is a joke. Yeah. yeah. Percy was just joking with Thomas. Even though Thomas doesn't like t Percy's teasing. Mm -hmm. Thomas wanted to pay back for all of Percy's teasing. Yeah, he does. Even though Thomas is cheeky. Yeah, he is. You know, like a nut. Bother! Uh, come on, Percy, can't you come with me, please? Thomas asked. Like a nut. Like, come on, Percy, I'm being serious. Can't you come with me? I don't want to get scrapped. Thomas asked. Like a nut. So come on, can't you come, please? Like a nut. I'm being serious, Thomas asked. Like a nut. Uh, even though, huh. I'm not kidding, Thomas, Percy said with a cheeky. You should go. You should go on your own. Even though, for goodness' sake, I even know. Hey, it's so hilarious. Mm -hmm. Even though, said Percy. And Percy laughed when he was just teasing Thomas. You should know. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, Thomas gulped. I I don't know about this, Percy. I'm scared, said Thomas. Even though, for goodness sake, yep. Mm -hmm. Thomas was really scared and paranoid. Uh, I don't know about this, Percy. 
if you say so, I, I, I guess I'll go. Uh-huh. Oh, my God. Just go, Thomas, said Percy. Uh, even though, for goodness sake, yeah, yeah, you can go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can go, Percy said. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you can go, said Percy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> hmm? said Percy laughing. Yeah, Percy was having too much fun. Mm. Thomas was really scared. He didn't know what to say. Uh, Percy, I'm scared. I don't know about the smelter's yard. And, uh, 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 it really makes me nervous. Thomas was shivering. He didn't know what to say. And all that the smelter's yard was really scary and all that stuff even though thomas was nervous so thomas decided to go and all that stuff mm -hmm. even though thomas shivered he went oh uh, i don't know about this i guess this has to be my own way said thomas even though <coughs> I don't like the looks of this, Thomas gulped. It was on a spooky day, but then he saw some troublesome trucks, and he bumped into them. He said, Uh-oh, this ain't good. Oh, no, Thomas said, and he closed his eyes and started to scream. Ah, Thomas said. Oh, dear God, I, I don't like the looks of this, I said. Dear God. Ah, oh, oh, my goodness. Please tell me when it's over, Thomas shrieked. Oh, dear God. Uh, tell me when it's over, Thomas shrieked. Oh, dear God. Oh. Percy laughed. Yeah, you see that? Percy laughed. Even though it's just your silly imagination. Mm-hmm. You're, you're such a scaredy train, Percy laughed. Even though for goodness sake. Mm-hmm. Percy laughed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Even though, for goodness sake, uh, mm -hmm. it's so hilarious, god dang it, Percy said. Mm -hmm. Yes, mm -hmm. Percy was laughing too hard. It made Thomas upset. Percy, I'm not having fun, Thomas said. It's just, you're trying to scare the crap out of me. Yes, you are. Uh-huh, and bother the smelter's yard. God dang it, I don't like the looks of this. And bust my puffers, Thomas said. Uh, well, I'm fine, I'll go to the smelter's yard, if you insist, Thomas said. Uh, it was finally dark, and Thomas decided to go look. Uh-huh, uh, ha, ha, hello, Thomas said when the smelter's yard door opened. Hello, Thomas said in a shriek, in a creeped way. <laughs> Hello, Thomas said again. It echoed in there. And then the door closed, and Thomas freaked out. Ah, what was that? Thomas said. <laughs> Hello? Oh my god. Uh, 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 I'm scared, Thomas said. Uh, I don't like the looks of this, Thomas said. And then the door really closed. Yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah, the door really closed. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah, and then he heard some sparks. Yeah, he did. <laughs> what was that? Thomas said. Oh, dear God, I don't like the looks of this place. This place really wants to scrap me, Thomas said. In the island of Sodor, I don't like the looks of this. Uh-uh, this is horrible, Thomas said. Oh, dear God, bust my buffers, Thomas said. Oh, dear God, I don't like the looks of this. Uh-uh. What am I hearing now? Thomas said. Oh, dear God. I don't like the looks of this. Uh-uh. This is horrible.
Thomas said. Oh dear God. <laughs> this makes my axles tingle, Thomas said. Oh dear God. This makes my pistons pump, Thomas said. Oh dear God, I don't like the looks of this. Uh-uh, no! This is, this is bad, really bad. Oh dear God, I don't like it at all. Uh-uh, no, this is bad, really bad. Uh, uh, what's that? Thomas said. Oh dear God, I don't like it at all. Uh-uh, this is horrible! <laughs> horrible! Oh dear God, uh, I don't like this at all. What the heck is this? said Thomas. <gasps> oh dear, this is bad, really bad. Oh dear God. Uh, uh, I don't like this place. It's creepy, said Thomas. Oh dear God. Uh, uh, oh dear Neptune. Uh, even though this is a scary place, said Thomas. Oh dear God. Oh my goodness. Uh, uh. Oh, I don't like the looks of this, uh, Thomas said. Oh, dear God, this is a really creepy place. Uh, 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 uh. Thomas shivered to death. Yeah, he did. Uh -huh. Even though Thomas didn't like the looks of this place, he did not. Uh-uh, the smelter's yard was a really scary place. Yes, it was. Uh-huh, even though, uh-huh. Sir Topham Hat said, t Sir Topham Hat told Thomas to, uh, to get some s steel girders and all that stuff. Yes, he did. Uh-huh. And Percy teased Thomas. Yes, he did. Uh-huh. Yes. But Thomas didn't listen. Well, he did, but he just didn't listen to Percy's teasing. No, he didn't. Bust my buffers! Thomas said. I don't like the looks of this place! Thomas said. It, who's that? Thomas said. He heard a scary whistle. Yes, he did. It went. <laughs> what was that? Thomas shrieked. Oh, dear God. Bust my buffers! Thomas said. Oh, dear God. I don't like the looks of this! Thomas said. Oh, dear Neptune! Uh, I don't like the looks of this! <sighs> Thomas breathed. Thomas breathed and he didn't like the looks of this. Uh-uh. <sighs> I have to back away! Thomas said. Oh dear God! <sighs> so Thomas backed away and he felt something. <sighs> what was that? Is that ghost hands? Thomas said. Oh dear God! I don't like the looks of this! Thomas said. <sighs> I don't like this at all, said Thomas. Oh dear God, this is so creepy. Oh my God. Get me out of here, said Thomas. I don't like this at all, said Thomas. Oh, get me out of here. Thomas was breathing too heavily. He didn't like this place, but he saw something that was very, very frightening. It was Diesel 10. Yes, it was. Hello! You looking for someone? He, he heard. Thomas heard a scary voice. Hello, Thomas. I work here. I work in the smelter's yard, said Diesel 10. And besides, I want to crush you. Yes, I do. Uh-huh, said Diesel 10. Even though... Diesel 10 was a really scary engine. Yes, yes he was. Uh-huh. Even though Diesel 10 was so frightening. Yes, he was. Uh-huh. Yes, yes he was. Yep. <clears throat> Don't get me wrong, Diesel 10 is such a scary engine. Yes, he is. Well, do you, you want me to kill you, Thomas? Or what? Said Diesel 10. Yeah, yeah, I'm waiting, Thomas, said Diesel 10. Yeah, uh-huh. Must be brave, must be brave, Thomas puffed. Uh, I, I don't like the looks of this, said Thomas. Please don't kill me, Thomas said. And I'm, I'm not worried, said Thomas. I, I just don't want you to kill me, said Thomas. 
uh, even though I, I just don't like the looks of this place. It's creepy, said Thomas. I, I, I don't know about this. Uh, uh, the smelter's yard is so creepy. Uh, even though Sir Topham Hatt told me to get some steel girders. Yes, he did. Uh-huh, said Thomas. Yes, uh-huh. Even though I, I, I'm just, I just don't know. Uh-huh, yes. Uh-huh. <gasps> uh, but then Thomas saw that Diesel 10 was gone. Yes, he did. Uh-huh. Yes, it's so true. Uh-huh. Like a nut. Uh-huh. Yes, it's so true. Uh-huh. Definitely. Thomas saw that Diesel 10 was gone for a few seconds. Yes. Uh-huh. Where'd he go? Thomas said, curious. And then he saw something else. Yes, he did. Thomas saw something else. Yes, he did. Uh-huh. <clears throat> yes, Thomas saw something else. Yes, he did. Uh-huh. Yes, definitely. Thomas did see something else. Yes, he did. Uh-huh. Yes. Y yes. Oh, wait, what's that over there? Thomas said, curious. Uh, uh, come out wherever you are, Thomas said bravely. I'm not afraid of you. Yeah, uh-huh, said Thomas. Even though, for goodness sake, I know what you're up to. Yes, uh-huh. I'm not scared, said Thomas. But then, something did pop out, and it surprised Thomas. Yes, it said, Thomas! Thomas! Ah! Screamed Thomas. Please don't hurt me! I'm not gonna hurt you! I just wanna get you for a reason! Why? Screamed Thomas. Because it's just for fun, dear lord! On the island of Sodor, you should trust me! I don't trust creeps like you, Thomas said bravely. I'm a brave engine. You should not trust me at all, Thomas said bravely. You, you, I don't trust you, said Thomas bravely. Oh my god, I should get out of here, Thomas said bravely. And I'm not afraid. Oh my god, you're going to regret this, Thomas said bravely. How do you think I'm going to regret this? said the ghost engine, because! Well, Diesel 10 heard all the arguing from Thomas and the ghost engine. <laughs> That's right! Get him, ghost engine! said the Diesel 10. Yeah, uh-huh. But Diesel 10 was furious and decided to butt in. Well, then, if you don't get him, ghost engine, I will get him for you! said Diesel 10. Even though, for goodness sake, uh huh. Even though, for goodness sake, Diesel 10 was really grumpy. Yes, he was. Yes, uh huh. Definitely. For goodness sake, yes. And, and don't get me wrong, Thomas shouldn't trust the, the ghost engine. Yeah, he shouldn't. Yeah. Well, Diesel 10 should. Yes, he should trust the ghost engine. Yeah, he should. Uh, why should I trust the ghost engine? Diesel 10 said. Because it's so creepy of you. You know. Uh, uh, Thomas heard Diesel 10 talking. Huh? Who's that? Thomas said surprisingly. Uh, uh, I don't like the looks of this place, Thomas said. Oh, I better get out of here before it's too late, Thomas said scared. Uh, I don't like the looks of this place. It's so creepy, said Thomas. Oh, I don't like it here. Uh, get me out of here. Jeez Louise, said Thomas. Uh, it's so creepy. I don't like it, said Thomas. Uh, oh my God. I should get out of here before I'm scrapped. Oh dear God. I don't want to be sent here for scrap, said Thomas. Uh, uh, the ghost engine will kill me, said Thomas. Mm. Mm, I don't like it here. Oh dear God, said Thomas. <sighs> like cinders and ashes, cried Thomas. Oh dear God, <sighs> I better get out of here. <sighs> oh dear God, 
<laughs> Thomas panted. Oh, dear God. Whew. <laughs> Thomas made it out of the smelters. Well, he almost did. He just made it out of the smelting shed. Yes, he did. Whew. But finally, I made it out of the smelting shed. But I'm still here in the smelter's yard, said Thomas, panting. Oh, dear God. What to do, what to do now, said Thomas. <laughs> I don't like the looks of this place, Thomas gulped. I don't like the looks of this place at all, said Thomas. But then, Thomas heard some creaking. Uh, well, what's that, said Thomas scared. Oh dear God, I don't like the looks of this place at all. Uh-uh, it's so creepy here. Top of Pat will be cross with me. Oh dear God, I better go back inside. Uh, I better do. Uh huh, said Thomas. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Hello, said Thomas. Uh, I'm not afraid of you. Come on out, please, said Thomas. Oh, dear God. I don't like the looks of this place at all. Uh uh. This place is so creepy, said Thomas, scared. Yes, but Thomas wasn't worried. No, he wasn't. He's a cheeky, brave engine. Yes, he is. Yeah, he is. Uh huh. You see, I am a cheeky brave engine. I love telling the story. Yes, I do. Uh-huh. Yes. So I decided to look around. Yes, I do. Well, you see, I am frightened, but I'm not really that frightened. I'm brave. You see, it's so interesting. I, I looked around the smelting shed. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. Even though, for goodness sake, yes, I did. Uh-huh. It's so interesting. Yes. Uh-huh. Well... <clears throat> it was interesting until I heard another noise. Yes, it was chains and claws. Yes, it was. I didn't want to be here for scrap, so I decided to look around some more. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. Like a nut. I heard Diesel 10 coming after me. Yes, I did. Well, for goodness sake, yes, I did. Uh-huh. Well, it's bad news. Thomas, said Diesel 10. I gulped. <clears throat> This isn't good, I said. Well, I, I said, what? I said, uh, d -d -d Diesel Ten. I shivered. Well, what do you want with me? I want you gone and scrapped, said Diesel Ten. Well, you see, I, I just want you gone, said Diesel Ten. And Sir Topham Hat did not tell you to come here for some steel girders. You should know that. But Sir Topham Hat did tell me to come here for some steel girders. Yes, he did. Thomas was telling the truth. Yes, he was. You see, I was telling the truth to Diesel 10. Even though, even though Diesel 10 tried to think of an excuse to get rid of me. No, he wasn't coming here for some scrap metal and all that. And he wasn't coming here for some steel girders. Diesel Ted, Diesel Ten said, as an excuse. Are Are you talking in your head? I said. Uh, no, I wasn't. Said Diesel Ten, lying. I think you're lying to me. Well, uh, well, said Diesel Ten. I I'm not. Said Diesel Ten, fibbing like a nut. Even though, for goodness' sake, I don't give a crap. Even though you should know that. Even though. You're just a barnacle head! Yes, so I think you should be like that, so bust my claw tender, said Diesel 10, like a nut, uh-huh. You're gonna regret it, uh-huh. You're gonna notice that, so. <sighs> Why would I help a steamy? He said, trying to let make me laugh, like a nut. But I didn't laugh. It was obvious. You see, Diesel 10 is such a big jerk. Yes, he is. Uh-huh. Even though he's a diesel, I know that. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I love telling this story. Uh-huh. Even though I am a tank engine, yes, I am. You see, I got chained up. Yes, I did. By Diesel 10. Yes, I did. Have fun being chained, Diesel 10 said. Ah, I didn't like this one bit, I said. Uh, unchain me at once, I said, like a nut. Uh, even though I hate being chained up in the smelter's yard, I got so scared, even though I had to get out at once. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. 
Even though I just didn't like this at once. No, I didn't. No, it was so creepy in here. I had to get out. Yes, I did. Uh, even though uh, I am Thomas. Yes, I am. I just didn't like it in the smelter's yard. No, I didn't. No, it was so creepy. Yeah, it was. God dang it. I didn't like it one bit. Uh-huh. Even though, like, once. Mm-hmm. Even though I'm everyone's favorite tank engine. Yes, I am. God dang it. Yes. <sighs> this is so obvious. I had to find a way out. So I did. I got unchained and decided to, to, to do it. Yes, so... Bust my buffers, I said. So I had to scram and get out of here. Yes, yeah, so I I got back. I I ran out of the smelter's yard backwards. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. Yes, I did. Yeah, I did, definitely. Uh-huh. Yes, yeah, so I got out of the smelter's yard. Yes, I did. With the, with the door behind me. Yes. Uh-huh. So I decided to do this. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. Like a nut. Uh-huh. Definitely. Yep. Mm-hmm. Even though, for goodness sake, the smelter's yard is creepy. Yes, it is. So, bust my buffers, I said. And, oh, I had to escape. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. So, the door opened behind me, so I had to scram. Yes, I did. And I was so scared. Diesel 10 had to chase me. Yes, he did. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh. Definitely, he did. Yes, this was a nightmare! Uh-huh, I was having a nightmare. Yes, I was. You see, mm -hmm. this is a horrible dream, you know. Yes, it was. Uh-huh. <clears throat> this is a horrible dream. Yes, it is. God dang it, I don't like this. Like, ugh. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. Uh, bust my boiler! I said. God dang it. So I had to... Uh, so, uh, when I left, the door closed. Yes, it did. Like, like that. You see, I wasn't in there anymore. Yeah, I wasn't. Yeah. This is so true, god dang it. Yeah. So, I was gone. Yes, I was. So, when I left, uh, the place was empty and quiet. But Diesel 10 was still in there. Yes, he was. Uh-huh. Yeah, he was still in there. But he was still after me. Yes, he was. Uh-huh, that is so true. Like, oh my goodness. Yes, I didn't like the place one bit. Uh-uh, no. It, like, the place almost scrapped me. Yes, it did. Uh-huh. So, I scrammed out of there, but for goodness sake. But, no. Oh, I, I went, Diesel 10, please don't hurt me. I said, like, what the heck? Ah, uh, even though I'm Thomas, yes, I am. But, you see... Uh, well, don't get me wrong. You see, I I was just trying to you know, look for some steel girders until Diesel 10 ruined everything here in the island of Sodor. Yes, at uh, the smelter's yard. Yes. Uh huh. But I went, bust my boiler and bust my buffers. Diesel 10, don't hurt me. God dang it. But he, Diesel 10 did not listen to me. No, he didn't. So I decided to escape. Yeah, I did. Uh-huh. But, oh my god, this is horrible, I said. So, I, I went... Oh, uh, I went out of there. Yes, I did. So, I decided to head back. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. Like a nut. Uh-huh. Like a nut. So, bust my buffers, I said. So, I decided to head back to Timnit Sheds, where I belong. Yeah, I did. So, I scrammed. Uh-huh, like a nut, uh-huh. I had to head back to tin the sheds as fast as I can. Like a nut, uh-huh. Yes, I did, uh-huh. Mm, like a barnacle head, yes, uh-huh. But I'm no barnacle head, no, no, I'm not. Diesel 10 is, yes, he is. But you see, uh-huh, like a nut, uh-huh. <clears throat> like a nut. <clears throat> Even though I had to head back to Tim the Sheds, yes, so I took the long track, yes I did. Uh-huh, cause I'm Thomas, yes I am, yeah. So, like a nut. You see, I had to escape Diesel 10, yes. Yeah, uh-huh, I did. Uh-huh, yeah, I was really scared, yes. Oh my god, I, I was really scared, yes I was. So I had to head back to Tim the Sheds. Oh my god, uh-huh, it was so true, god dang it, yeah, uh-huh, like a nut, uh-huh, 
It's so true. Oh my god, dear lord! Oh my goodness! Ugh. I had to get out of there. So I said, Ghost! A ghost! Oh dear god! A ghost is after me! Oh dear god! I had to head out of there. Yes. Uh huh. Like a nut. Uh huh. Oh my god! <sighs> like a barnacle head. So I said, uh, Help me! A ghost! Oh dear god! Uh, a diesel tan is after me! I cried. Oh dear god! <sighs> oh my god! I didn't like it one tiny bit, I said, like a barnacle head. Ugh, it's so barnacle-ish. Like, what the heck? Ugh, even though, for goodness sake, ugh, even though I didn't like it one tiny bit, uh-uh, no, I said. Ugh, even though, like, I said, Diesel Tan is after me, I cried. Like, what the heck? Ugh. Even though I had to come up with something, yes I did. Uh huh. So I headed back to Tim the sheds. Yes I did. Uh huh. Yes I did. Uh huh. And so I, so I was back at Tim the sheds, and I sighed with relief. Yes I did. Uh huh. Yeah I did. I went. Whew! That was a close one. I said. Yes. Whew! Mm, yes. Uh huh. Even though. Yes. It's so true, god dang it. <laughs> you see, well, don't get me wrong, I was really scared. Yeah, I was. <laughs> well, Percy teased me for a darn reason, e even though he's my best friend. Yes, he is. Yeah, he is. Uh-huh. Yeah, even though my fr other friends aren't here right now. Yeah, except Percy. He's just having fun delivering the mail right now and my other friends are just pulling the express and all that stuff yeah here on the island of sodor yep definitely i'm just alone here at tidnip sheds right now but it's okay yeah definitely <laughs> i was just scared yeah definitely yeah you see i'm just having fun right now yeah but then i decided to do this right now yes yeah, it's so true. So I decided to close my eyes again. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's so cool, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it's so cool. So I went... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I moaned in my sleep, but then my eyes got tighter and tighter. But I went... Mm -hmm. Like that. Yes, I did. Uh-huh. Yes, I did. But... Mm -hmm. Yes, but then well, I accidentally woke up, but then I went, I went, uh, uh, uh. I screamed in my sleep. Ah! I said, God dang it. Oh, what happened? Oh, dear God. I said, uh, I didn't, that was the worst dream I ever had. I said, oh, dear God. I didn't like that dream. But then Percy decided to show up. And he said, Thomas, Thomas, you okay? Thomas, Thomas, you okay? Yeah, well, uh, but I was really sad. I didn't feel like ta doing nothing right now. But I I sighed with relief, but I, I didn't know what to say to Percy. Like or not, uh-huh. Yeah, even though Percy decided to check up on me, I was so sad when I had this nightmare, yes, but at least it was just a dream, yeah, it was, even though, <clears throat> even though Percy decided to check on me, yeah, uh-huh, yeah, well, he said this at me, Thomas, you okay, it's just a bad dream, Percy said, he, it was just a bad dream, are you okay, Percy said, y yeah, even though I was in your dream, I I just had to tell you a tale of the, uh, you know, of the smelter's yard. Yeah, I played a trick on you. Yes, I did. Uh huh. Yes, I did play a trick on you, didn't I? You, you silly boy. Yeah, you silly train. Yes. Uh huh. You should know that. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. You, you should know that, Thomas. <laughs> it's okay, Thomas. It's just a bad dream. You should know that. Uh huh. <laughs> you just had a bad dream. That's all," said, t said Percy. Yeah. Uh huh. 
You just had a bad dream, that's all. Yes, you did. Uh-huh. Yeah. Are you okay, Thomas? You just had a bad dream. All I t did was tell you a tale of the smelter's yard. Yeah. Uh-huh. Well, bother the smelter's yard, I said. Even though I'm not going back to that place again. Because that place thinks it wants to scrap me. Yes, I said. Even though, Percy, I don't, I'm not falling for your teasing again. I want to pay you back for all your teasing, I said. Like a nut. Uh-huh. Even though you're going to regret it, I said. Uh-huh. Yes, I said crossly. You, you should know that. Uh-huh. You're going to notice that, Percy, I said. Yes, you should know this. Uh-huh. Like a nut. Yes, I said. Like a nut. Aw, don't worry, Thomas. I, I, I'm sorry. I promise I won't do that to you again. It's just a funny way. I was just being funny, that's all. And I'm sorry I told you the tale of the smelter's yard. Yes. Uh-huh. It's okay, Thomas. You can have fun with me. Yes, I'll go with you next time. Yes, I will. You will, Percy? Mm. You will, Percy? Thomas gulped. You will, Percy? I gulped. Uh, uh, just don't tell that tale again. It kind of scared me. Yes, it did, I said, like a nut. So, even though, just don't do that again, like a nut. Even though, I have to head back to Timnit Sheds. So I headed back to Timnit Sheds and all that stuff. Yes, I did. And everything was back to normal. Yes, it was. Uh-huh. Even though, for goodness sake, yes, here on the island of Sodor, yes, uh-huh, even though, for goodness sake, uh, yep, that's true, my friend, yep, mm-hmm, even though everything was okay, yes, it was, uh-huh, yes, everything was all right, yep, definitely, yeah, uh-huh, yes, everything was okay, yes, even, even though, for goodness sake, Percy, I love you. I love you as a friend, Percy. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Aw, Thomas, I love you too. Uh -huh. You're the best friend I could ever have. Even though you're an awesome best friend. Yes, said Percy. You, you're just an awesome best friend I could ever have. Yep, definitely. Uh huh. You're just an awesome best friend. Yes, you are. Even though I like you. Yeah. Uh huh, said Percy. I just like you as a best pal, Thomas. Yeah, Percy said. And one other thing. Don't forget that there are monsters out there, said Percy. And you better watch out because it's so important. Yes. You know, for goodness sake, I just love you, Thomas, as a friend. Yeah, said Percy. Yeah, uh-huh. Oh, I love you too, Percy, said Thomas. Yeah, it's so important, I said. Even though it's so important to me, said, I said. Like an awesome fella. Yes, uh-huh. Even though, for goodness sake. Yep, mm-hmm. Yep, even though, for goodness sake. Yep. Mm. Like, oh my goodness. Yep, uh-huh. Yes, definitely. Uh huh. Like a nut. Uh huh. Yes. Uh huh. Even though I'm not going back to the smelter's yard ever again. Yes. Indeed. Uh huh. Like a barnacle head. I don't want to do that again, Percy. Uh uh. No. Well, how did you guys like the story? Was it fantastic? Yeah. Was it? <laughs> well, I'm glad you all liked the story. Yep. Mm hmm. Yeah, that was my tale of the smelter's yard, of how I entered the smelter's yard. Yep, uh-huh, yep, that was true, my friend. Yep, hope you guys enjoyed the video and all that stuff. Yeah, uh-huh, here on the island of Sodor. Yeah, uh-huh, and uh, I, Percy did play a trick on me, but he apologized. Yes, he did. He won't do that again, he promised, but... Yeah, there'll be more, trust me, but 
also. And I hope you guys like this video. Like and subscribe and all that stuff. Yeah. Uh-huh. See you guys later. Yeah. And I hope you guys like the story I told. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> it's so impressive, ain't it, guys? Uh-huh. And sorry if it spooked you, but also this story is not for kids two and up. Two for five-year-olds. You should know. Yes. Yeah, you should know that. Uh-huh. Even though I'm an awesome character. Yes. Uh-huh. And uh, I hope you guys put put a like on this video and all that stuff. And I hope you guys like this video. So see you guys. Yeah. Uh-huh. And also, and you'll love this. Uh-huh. See you guys. And I hope you like me. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> and also, uh -huh. and I hope you like this story. So see you guys. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Hope you like this, guys. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, definitely. Here's a special message from Thomas and Bowser Jr. If you're watching this, here's a special message for you. I hope you like me. And besides, and you're liking this. Yes, you are. Yep. And you're going to love me. Yes, you are. And you're going to notice. Yeah. Uh huh. You can watch this video whenever you want. And because, because I'm your favorite tank engine. Yes, I am. Uh huh. Yeah. Uh huh. I just want to make you laugh because I'm your favorite tank engine. Yes, I am. Uh-huh. And besides, you're an awesome best friend to me. Yes, you are, Bowser Jr. And yes. And also, yes. Uh-huh. And all of you guys out there, if you like me a lot, uh -huh, put a like on this video. Yeah. Uh-huh. And besides, you're an awesome best friend. Yeah. Uh-huh. You're awesome best friends to me. Yeah. Uh-huh. I like you guys a lot. Yeah. Uh-huh. Because you're too cool to me. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yes, you are. So see you guys. Uh-huh. Yes. Because choo-choo, I'm Thomas the Tank Engine. I hope you guys like me. Yeah. Uh-huh. You guys are so awesome to me. Yeah. You are. Uh-huh. Definitely. I like you guys a lot, uh-huh, because you're so awesome to me. Yeah, and I hope you guys like the story I told. Yep, uh-huh, mm -hmm. because it's so fantastic. Yep, uh-huh, mm -hmm. because you guys are way awesome. Yeah, and Bowser Jr., if you're, you, if you're watching this video, you can watch me whenever you want. Yeah, you can, uh-huh, because you're so awesome to me. Yes, you are, uh-huh. Because I like you a lot! Yeah! Uh-huh. You... Because I'm so happy that you play with me a lot. Yes, you do. Uh-huh. And besides, you're way awesome to me. Yeah! Uh-huh. Yeah! <laughs> because I like to make you happy. Because I know you're a big fan of me. Yes, you are, Bowser Jr. Yeah! Uh-huh. Yeah. And because you're so cool. Yes, you are. 
Uh-huh. And besides, you're way awesome. Yes, you are. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's the awesome message from me. Yes. And I hope... And also, besides, and also, you should know this. Did you like the story I made? Yeah. Uh-huh. It was so cool, wasn't it? Yeah, it was, wasn't it? And I hope you like this video and put a like and all that. Uh-huh. And press the thumbs up button. Yeah. And also, mwah, from, from your best pal, Thomas. Yeah. Uh-huh. And hope you like it. God dang it. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's so cool, ain't it? I like to make you laugh, Bowser Jr., because you're awesome. Yeah. Uh-huh. You're so swell, aren't you? Yes, you are. Uh-huh. Because you're so swell to me. I like you as a friend. Yes. Uh-huh. Yes, you are. Uh-huh. <clears throat> yes, you're so swell to me. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yes, you're so swell. I like you. Uh-huh. Because you're an awesome best pal to me. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. I like you, Bowser Jr. You're so swell! Yeah! Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yes. Even though it's so cool. Yeah. Definitely, my best friend. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah! Definitely. Uh-huh. Yes. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's so cool, my best pal. Yeah. Mm, that's the special message, and I hope you like it. Uh-huh. <laughs> and Bowser Jr., you deserve a hug from me. Yeah, uh-huh. And I love you lots. Uh-huh. Hope you enjoy. Love you. Mwah!